What's up, you baggies? Dan Barnett here, 27th of February 2022. We're looking ahead to the Swansea game at home tomorrow. Um, we've played these guys a fair few times before. Uh, in the last 10, we've won four, lost three. Uh, the average score is around 2-1. Uh, we had two home defeats in the last 10 um, home meetings, obviously against these guys so it's a fairly respectable record uh in terms of Swansea um but Steve Bruce claims this is a big game for us in terms of challenging for playoff spaces and in terms of confidence um but uh I beg to differ to be honest um the team just looks bereft of confidence and talent quite frankly and um I think the season's pretty much in tatters after the last three games against uh, teams in those playoff spaces. Uh, those were the three big games uh, that we needed to come away with nine points from. Um, we came away with basically nothing. Um, so I just don't see. I don't see how he thinks we're going to be challenging for the playoffs. I mean, strictly speaking, on a math mathematical basis, they are uh, achievable, sure, but. When you look at the table, it's all over the place in terms of people. I mean, teams' true positions. Uh, when you got this team with so many games in hand, and this team on this many points, and it's just really confusing. Um, the only way that we could even think about challenging uh, is going on an unbeaten, but well, a winning run towards the end of the season. Now. Um, but I, I really, I really don't see it. Um, also, in the news yesterday, um, there was an article discussing Romain Sawyer's. Um, he obviously returned to the Stoke side yesterday, three months um, out uh, with an injury. Um, his contract's obviously up at the end of the season. Um, we have an option to extend by one year. Stoke are interested, um, but it's the ball's obviously in our court in terms of the extension. Um, I think personally that we could use a player like Remain in the side uh, from here on forward because we've obviously lacked um, midfield players and creative midfield players at that. I think um, he was left a bit hung out to dry under Slav. It's one of one of the only things I could say bad about Slav was his management of Romain, to be honest. Uh too many times I've seen him uh behind the last defender. Um he he just didn't have too much chances to uh do what he does best and pick passes. Um so I see him as more a creative midfielder that we could definitely, definitely use uh next season. Um let me know your thoughts on the game tomorrow in the comments and let me know if you think Remain has a future in the side. Uh, until tomorrow, come on you baggies!